All right, mi gente, guys, we're installing an indirect hot water heater from Well McLean. So just to let you know, guys, an indirect hot water heater is a little different than a normal hot water heater. Basically, an indirect hot water heater is be being basically getting hot water from your boiler, right? So you're getting water from the boiler and you're heating up an external coil, which we call an indirect hot water heater, opposed to a traditional hot water heater, which is self-contained, self-independent, meaning it actually has a burner on the bottom heating up the water and it's independent, has nothing to do with the boiler. So guys, I want to show you guys. So the tapping, you got to make sure where you connect the tapping. So right here is for your hot water supply. Here's your domestic hot water. That's your cold water in, which is on the bottom. Then of course you have your boiler supply and your turn. So basically, if you can think of it this way, it's the most easiest way I can make you guys envision in your brain. Think of it like a baby bottle. Remember back in the day when you were a kid and your mom or grandma or your dad, whoever, was heating up the baby bottle of your milk? So what happened? So think of the pot in water, that's the boiler, right? The burner is the actual, the boiler burner, right? Or in this case, the burner from the gas stove, that's what's heating up the water. But remember guys, you're heating up the milk. So you have heat transfer from the water going through the plastic, heating up the milk. So basically think of this like a big baby bottle, if that makes any sense for you guys. So the, the coil is inside, that's the hot water, but inside the hot water, we're simulating the, the scenario I'm telling you, let's say the milk, the milk is your domestic hot water in this case, there's a coil. And then around the coil is your hot water, which will be the water in the pot. So if you can think of it that way or envision it, that is exactly what's going on here. So you have something called heat transfer. Heat transfer goes from the hot water to the coil wall into the domestic water. And that's how you make the magic happen. That's how you get hot water. So guys, if you have any questions, call Louis the Boilerman. Stay tuned. Wempa. Louis, Louis.